Hi, this is Shirley. Welcome to Shirley's Kitchen. Today I'm going to prepare very authentic spicy pindi chole. So let's get started. For pindi chole, here I have two cups of soaked chole. I soaked them overnight, washed them thoroughly, and now I'm going to boil them. Here I'm preparing one portly just to give some flavor and color of the chole. So I'm adding one or two bay leaf, few cloves, three, four cardamom, one cinnamon stick, three, four spoon tea powder. Here I am boiling the water. Make a tight knot. You can use any cloth. Muslin cloth will be the better. Portly, place it into the water. Add teaspoon of salt. Pressure cook it in low medium heat and give 4 to 5 whistle. Let's open. You can see chole is perfectly cooked. Take out the potli. For chole, let's make the masala. Coriander powder, half teaspoon turmeric powder, one teaspoon red chili powder, anardana powder, and half teaspoon black salt. Chole masala is ready. For chole, I have one teaspoon of ginger, one teaspoon of garlic, one onion puree, one tomato puree. For garnish, I have slit green chilies and mustard oil. So now let's prepare the chole. Turn on the heat. I'm adding two tablespoon of mustard oil. Now I'm adding the onion puree. Add one teaspoon ginger, one teaspoon garlic. Now strain the chole. Don't throw this water, we will use it later. Add half teaspoon asafoetida. Onion cooked nicely. Now I'm adding tomato puree. Along with the tomato, I am adding the whole chole masala. Mash lightly. You can see masala is nicely fried. Now I am adding all the chole and cook one more minute. Now I am adding this water. I don't want my chole to be very watery I am adding the whole now cook it in medium heat for 2 minutes I like this consistency so I am turning it off now I am going to tempering the chole in a pan I am adding 1 tablespoon of ghee and I am adding few garlic garlic fried nicely I'm adding few slit green chili turn off the heat add the tempering into the chole pindi chole is ready to serve you can eat pindi chole with naan paratha rice I hope you like my today's recipe if you like it, share it with your family and friends. See you next time. Till then, eat fresh, stay healthy.